Okay, so we've got these in. Look at that. Fabulous. Curved, as it should be. Curving across. Uh, just one thing. These nuts do seem to be touching the top of the plate. And we need to get it in a bit further. It's uh, not level with bottom, which I might not do it level with bottom. I might just leave it in inset a little bit. So I'm just going to machine a bit of relief so we can get the nut off in the future if we ever need to get the nuts off. Um, and I might do the other side because they're very close to the pins. So I might just go all the way across uh, and just put a bit of relief in. Only need a little bit, just enough to spin the nut. dusted off around the top where we're going to be welding it on so now all I've got to do is get these um, in here set up and weld it in yeah we'll, we'll get them welded in I think in a minute after a brew and then we can get it on here that'll be nice see the back of this thing Put some bits of uh, TIG wire, which are pretty constant in size, and I'm going to put those in the slot. Into the slot, tappity tap, It's now set 1.5 mil up off the top of the bench. Everything's clamped down. These are now clamped down in place, so we can now put some uh, tacks on it.
So after a bit of messing about, welding, cleaning, it looks like that. And that's where it goes. Uh, but it's all welded. Uh, MIG welded around the ends. And it goes on there like so. And because these bearings are angled, it means that if we just roll it, it curves across. I still have to do a bit of work on these, but I'm well happy with that. It does exactly what it should do. I've just temporarily put the assembly of the pony truck on top of the assembly we've just done, and then put the box section on to replicate the rail. We're getting like a ruler thickness gap uh, between the box and this wheel. Obviously it's touching this wheel and the wheel at the front, but you've got to remember, once this is turned over, there's going to be a lot of weight pushing down. So this is where the springing arrangement to push everything back up is going to come into play. So I'm really chuffed with that. It's worked out really well. And uh, it means that we can get this finished. Finally. If you haven't already, then please do click the subscribe button and the notification bell and you'll be notified when we next release a video. And don't forget to click the like button and that will help it get around the YouTube algorithm system and uh, it'll get shared to like-minded people like yourself. And if you really enjoyed this video, then if you click here, you can enjoy that one too. So stay safe. Laters! This is brilliant. Brilliant.